everyone, Jazz here. This is going to be a little bit of a different video. This game it was actually a uni project I'm working on. Burbout's currently on hold, but I'll quickly do a little bit of work on it on the holidays and then finish it off after the semester is over. But in the meantime, I'm making this game as part of an assignment as a holdover, mainly because I wanted to see what something would be like as a space shooter. Also, it's out on itch.io if you want to have a play of it. I'll put the link down in the description. Without further ado, enjoy. Hey everyone, Jazz here, and today I'll be showing off a quick demonstration of the new Sunny game, Sunny Takes Flight. Just to start out, I'll be showing off the intro cutscene. For context, this is a side game to another game I am making called Burb Out, which is the origin game for the characters. For this, I want to go with a show-don't-tell form of cutscene, which is why there is no text other than the poster. This was made using sprite masks and the timeline feature instead of being hard-coded. Just as a quick plot synopsis, essentially Sunny sees a poster for the Seed Festival, the plovers plug up the warp nest using planks in that, and Sunny finds a hole in her cage and escapes. As for the gameplay, you'll probably be surprised to know that I went with a space shooter, since I put in a special request to make this style of game. I am so happy that the gameplay format of Sunny works so well with the shmup genre. The setup of the level is this. Shoot all the plovers until they die, and that's it. I want to keep the gameplay simple and straightforward to the point where the controls are viewable on one screen. You get three weapons, normal, wave, and spread, and they all fire as you tap or hold down space. Enemies only get one though. If you take too much damage you lose, and if you clear out all the plovers you win. In terms of graphics, I made them in Inkscape and rendered them through the Vector Graphics plugin in Unity, and made the music in Open Mob Plug Tracker using the same instruments used in Burbout's OST for consistency. So, yeah, Sony Takes Flight's gameplay is pretty cut and dry. There is one hidden mechanic where you can graze projectiles for extra points. It has its own hurt box, so to speak, but Sony's actual damage hurt box is way smaller than the sprite, which makes for way more lenient gameplay. There are also a few other essential features. I implemented a pause menu with the ability to restart and quit to the menu. I also decided to make the cutscene its own button on the main menu, as shown before. And I also decided to implement another burb out feature, where the main menu doubles as the pause menu. Lastly, you can also quit out of the game from the main menu. And that's all there is to it. Sunny Takes Flight is very simple by design to reflect the arcade era it's based on, and I like where it's headed. Other than extra content and more levels, music, graphics, and weapons, there are a few things I would like to improve. An extra few graphical touches I would like to make are a death animation for Sunny and the Plovers, more variation in the clouds, possibly using randomization, and a better drawn version of the last cutscene image. I would also probably include an indicator for the graze mechanic, and I also plan to change up the HUD with icons. Other than that, thanks for watching, and I hope you all have a nice day. Hey everyone, um, this is the end of the part of the video that was part of um, my uni assignment. I'm sort of going off the cuff here. I just want to say thank you all in the Discord server for being uh, really patient with me. I know this has been hard. I know the whole work from home thing has delayed burb out, and it's made... Um, my life and a bunch of our lives a bit, you know, harder, especially in terms of uh, getting stuff out that we want to make and uh, sharing that with the world and stuff like that. Um, I'm grateful that everyone is still, you know, with me and is still interested in Burb Out, and I hope you guys enjoy this uh, little detour. If anything, I think having this make Sunny a series just sort of strengthens Burb Out as well, because. Uh, you can flip-flop between the two games and you can have fun with both of them. And who doesn't love more Sunny content? I know I do because... Well, of course I made it, but I kind of just want to also see the series succeed off of concept alone and off its own merits and the characters and that that I've made. I am planning on finishing off Burb Out and providing updates and supporting it, but until then, Thank you all for watching, I'm grateful for every one of you for sticking around, and I hope you all have a good time, and see you soon.